Hello and welcome, my name is Chris Pixel, otherwise known as Pixel Monster, and this is 10 Seconds to Self-Destruct by Gritfish. This is a game made for the Ludum Dare, uh, or Ludum Dare, however you want to pronounce it, um, where the theme is 10 seconds, and I have 10 seconds to self-destruct, apparently. Uh, oh, look at that, I got past that level. Uh, this is a really short game, the developer said, that, uh, it is possible to do in, he said, it is at least doable in 60 seconds. Like, the entire game is doable in 60 seconds. So I'm assuming that means that there is six rounds, uh, six levels, I don't know. Maybe this is all procedurally generated, I don't know, I haven't played far enough into this. Um, ah, oh, man. So, I'm going to, uh, see how well I can do this, but I have never been a good platformer, and, uh, so I do not give any promises. Oh, balls. Oh, balls. Okay, let's try that one more time. I like that path. That path looks good. Um, the only problem I'm having- Oh wait, I can run! I forgot I can run. Oh my gosh. The only problem I'm having is that I- The controls are a bit iffy, um, but what platformer has good controls on the, on the keyboard, really? Um, oh god, I'm not gonna get past this one. This is too many turns. Oh, wow. I'm a magician. Um. Ah! <laughs> I don't know what I'm <laughs> I can't jump properly. Okay. There's a bit of, uh, positioning errors occasionally. But besides that, nothing. No, no biggies. Um. No, oh, oh. If there is one problem I have with this game, that there is no sound. Hopefully I have added sound to the video. Um. The developer said he didn't have enough time to make any sound. I'm just gonna... Oh, I reset? No, that's not what I meant to do. <laughs> Wait, did that just take me to the next level? If I d did, then hey, developer bug. Okay, I can't get down this hole like an idiot. Um. There we go. So I don't know how many levels are in this game. Uh, he said that he was going for a Super Meat Boy vibe, which is, uh, he, I think done. Uh, the only problem is that Super Meat Boy, a, a big influence on that game, is the sound. Like, the music and the art and, uh, as well as the fast-paced adventures, uh, and the rage quitting, which, this game, I'll admit, is making me a bit ragey. Um, <laughs> uh, it has nice wall jumping mechanics. Not the best, but nice. Um... This could potentially be a very good game. Oh, I survived! Thanks for playing! Um, this could potentially be a very good game. I, uh, like the graphics. They aren't the best. Um, let me reset. Now, I don't know if me resetting will end this video or not. Uh, if it does, then the next video will be alright after this. So, maybe see you in a second? I don't know. Um, so here we are again. Here we are again. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba. So let's go a different way than last time. Um... So, I like the art to a degree, like the pixel art for the little girl guy thing, um, is a bit interesting. Uh, not interesting, just like, I, I, I don't understand what they're doing. I wish they had more animations, but of course, um, animations can be hard to make. Oh, I don't want to go this way again, I went this way last time. Oh, no, don't go that way, Chris. Oh, Chris Pixel, why? 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 <laughs> I can't get up this stupid ledge. Oh, well, I'll just tell you for my time. Um. Blah. Sorry about that. I had a, I had a throat bubble. And apparently I can't do basic platforming. Um, another thing that to say about this game is that, like how I said that this was majorly influenced by Super Meat Boy. Um, Super Meat Boy excels again for having expert level uh, controls I, I, you could say um, some would disagree uh, well actually I don't think many people do, could disagree with the controls I think the controls were, have always been pretty solid by most people um, but these are I don't really like the inertia um, oh god <laughs> and I can't really uh, go exactly where I want to go because of the inertia uh, when I jump or when I move, I slide more so than I want to. I, uh, it just jumps a bit odd. Like, you know how most jumping games, you jump a little bit higher if you hold down the button. 
uh, here's pressing the button right now, and, okay, here is me pressing the button, here is me holding the button, there's no visual difference that I can tell, um, and if there is, then it's very minimal and not enough gameplay wise, um, sometimes I want that tiny jump, sometimes I want the big jump, um, I do like the wall jumping though, uh, <laughs> it's interesting, this path leads me nowhere, uh, I'm an idiot, um, so yeah, but uh, this is a very good game. Uh, this is going to be a very short episode. I know uh, all the Ludum Dare games will more than likely be pretty short. Um, but I'm going on a spree today and playing as many Ludum Dare games as possible. I have a huge list of at least 20 games. Uh, I'm probably not going to get through them all. But uh, why can't I get past this one part? Have I already done this before? Oh, balls. <laughs> okay, um, I'm getting I'm getting past this before I leave, but uh, this will be my last level probably. I'm sorry, I am so sorry that this is a very short episode. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, okay, okay. Oh gosh. No, I said I like the wall jumping. I like it because it keeps me on the wall. But it is not uh, pinpoint accurate at all. Um, or if it is, it might be actually, but I just suck. Um, another thing this game is lacking is graphics, which 48 hours to make 48 hours. Is it 48 hours? Or, um, three days to make the game. I really should be able to calculate. Three, two, 48 hours is two days, so uh, I don't know. I don't know. I think the game jams are in 48 hours. Actually, I really need to do more research on Ludum Dare, or Ludum Dare, however you want to pronounce it. Um, there we go! No! Okay. Okay, I know this is getting pathetic, watching me fail this much, but, um, get used to it if you're gonna keep watching my videos. <laughs> uh, thank you guys for watching. My name is Chris Pixel, otherwise known as Pixel Monster, and I know this episode is very short. Seven minutes, what? But uh, I hope to make up for that by at least publishing a few more videos in the next few minutes, actually. I hope that uh, this video will go out the same uh, day my next few videos will go out. Obviously, they're not going to be in the next few minutes because it does take a little while to upload a video onto YouTube. But it shouldn't be very long. Um, so, thank you guys for watching. And to Gritfish, if you are watching this video, I like your game. I really do. Uh, it has great art. Well, great art for the little girl inside the suit, which I'm assuming is to be a little girl, because I see blonde hair, uh, generally female, uh, female anime eyes, but in pixel form, of course. Um, and the suit art itself is very gorgeous. I like the background. Um, it's nice to look at. It's something interesting. It, it didn't bother me too much. It, it feels like I'm in a space station, which I feel is the premise of what you're trying to go for. Um, because the exit, there was a space station. How do you get past this? <gasps> I was so close. Okay, okay. You know how I was just closing out a second ago? I'm going to finish this level. I'm going to finish this level right now. Ah, balls! <sighs> Three more tries. <laughs> if this was your intent, Gritfish, then you succeeded in your game. Okay, okay. That's it. That's it. That is it. I love you. I love all you viewers. I love you, Gritfish, for making this game. Um, and you know what? Yeah, I love you. Um, thank you guys for watching, and uh, bye bye. Sorry, I forgot one more thing to say. Um, you'll notice that the game is still running, but I, I just decided. Anyways, um, one more thing to say that is there a link? There is a link in the description to download this game for yourself. Obviously, it is free for the Little Dare Challenge. Um, I highly recommend it, as I do with all games, um, even if, uh, like, if you don't like platformers and speedrunning and stuff like that, then don't play this game, really, um, but if you do enjoy games like that, then go ahead and try it out for yourself. Uh, that is all. Now goodbye. This is the real goodbye.